My dear child, my love for you overflows and I cannot stay silent. My affection for you pours out naturally, like a living river coursing through your being, bringing you the happiness you seek and need. My precious one, I observe you closely throughout each day. I delight in seeing you run back and forth, chasing your dreams, striving for your life. It fills me with joy to witness that spark of faith shining in your eyes. When you encounter problems and unexpected challenges, you lean on your faith, no longer filling with anxiety. You carry on as if nothing happened. If your world begins to crumble, you use your faith as a shield, and that pleases me greatly. When your adversaries rise against you, you again rely on your faith and stand with courage, for you are certain that no matter what happens, no one can stand against you, because I am with you. I cherish being part of your life, knowing you welcome me early on. Although your home may feel humble and small to you, I see the greatness of your faith and heart. One day I will open your eyes to the illumination of my presence in your home, revealing the thousands of angels surrounding you, showcasing all the blessings I can bestow upon you when you offer your willing heart and respond with sincere love to the affection I give you. When you cling to me like a child, believing with innocence and sincerity, when I say I love you, you believe me wholeheartedly without asking for proof to feel secure in my love. You believe without seeing me. You feel my presence but do not demand proof to trust me with all your soul and mind. Blessed are you because your eyes have not seen me, but with faith and sincerity you have believed. Blessed are you because I have found no pride in you. I admire your humble spirit, your fervent desire to love me and your family. You are greatly pleasing to me. You will be blessed in the good things you wish to do. Your future is secure in my hands. Continue to believe in my love and promises. Hold fast to your faith, for it is your shield and strength. Know that I am always with you, watching over you, guiding your steps. Trust in my unwavering love and let it fill your heart with peace and joy. Today, I have heard your prayer and felt the urgency to respond. I come to you with an open heart to tell you how deeply I love you. This is a new dawn, and it is no accident that these words have reached you when you needed them most. For days, you have sensed my desire to converse with you, and today, your heart is open to listen and renew our sacred covenant. Your pleas have not gone unnoticed. Believe this truth so that anxiety does not grip you with the falsehood that your words are lost in the void. I have heard you from the very beginning. My ears have always been attentive to your cries, and I will continue to listen even in your moments of anguish. You do not offend me. I am not angered when you raise your voice. I see your bowed head, your heart's deep humility, and your sincere devotion. I am listening and I will always listen. Please speak to me, I long to hear your voice. Your words are the reflection of your thoughts, and knowing that you keep a place for me in your mind is a pure and tender praise. Share with me your dreams, your needs, your plans, your frustrations, and your doubts. Speak to me because I am your friend, understanding your longing for peace and calm. The winds of adversity have indeed battered you. You have faced unexpected trials and the sting of contempt and cruelty has wounded your soul. Yet strength will come through my word. You will find peace amidst afflictions and calm when you feel weak. You will be strong, and when you feel faint, you need not fear. Hold tight to my promise, and when your burden feels too heavy, come to me. Remember, I am always with you. Do not let doubt steal the blessings that lie ahead on your path. I bless you because I love you, and I have chosen to do so. I shower you with grace and mercy because you are precious to me. My love for you is unbreakable and eternal. I do not change my mind with the passing times. 
Believe in me, and rivers of life will flow from within you. Trust in me, and you will find the courage, the spirit, and the power to overcome the forces of darkness. I will not abandon you. If you accept my forgiveness and let go of your past, all the promises in my word will become real for you. As the world turns and whispers of wars are heard, do not cease to pray. Write in your prayer book the names of those you cherish. Tell me what you desire for them. Though I already know, I understand their lives and thoughts, I want you to exercise your faith, to learn to pray for what truly matters. Even though those around you tremble in fear at the signs, neither you nor your family should be afraid. I will not leave you nor forsake you. You must be prepared while others are paralyzed by fear. You will witness great miracles. The trumpets are sounding. Your time of liberation is near. But today, pray, believe, fight, live. Do not be frightened by what may come. Trust in my word. Nothing is impossible for me. I love you. Tell me you love me. I delight in hearing it from you. I am with you. But first, affirm your belief in me. Speak it. Write it. I long to hear it. Listen to me with sincere faith and soon your soul will be calmed and your heart filled with peace. I am always with you. When you feel your life has stalled and you see no victory, time moves on. But in your life, nothing changes. I am with you, waiting for you to discern my will and my word. There you will see that everything works for good and nothing is in vain. You do not need storms for me to rescue you. I am with you even on calm days. If you feel you are not progressing, relax, stop overthinking, and enjoy a period of tranquility. When you have tried everything, sought answers and solutions and found neither purpose nor reason for your suffering, I am here to show you the way. But give me time and do not search in the wrong places. Do not ask just anyone. Do not imagine reasons or answers. Give me your mind and the worry you feel when nothing makes sense when you are frustrated and lost. When the shadows of anxiety obscure your vision and you're unsure of the way forward, lean on the promise I have given you, the assurance of my unfailing love. Why do you let worry consume you? I am watching over you. You are not governed by your emotions nor enslaved by fear. I did not give you a spirit of timidity but of power, love, and self-discipline to overcome any challenge. Your faith is your guiding light, and my Holy Spirit is the divine wind that steers you towards freedom and blessing. Do not fear, for I am by your side. Do not be discouraged. Do not be disheartened. Do not let the negative things you see rob you of your faith. I am your God, your Father, your King, your friend. I will strengthen and help you. I am coming at the perfect time for you to see my power manifested, so you recognize that I have a plan for you. And no matter what, I will always love you. I came to find you in your weakest moment when you were saddest. I came and showed you that you are very important to me. I will not tire of telling you, and you will not tire of hearing it, because you need it. No weapon forged against you will prosper, and you will condemn every tongue that rises against you in judgment. Whoever invents slanders and lies against you and your family rises against me. My beloved child, your feelings are precious, your dreams are beautiful, and your heart is tender. Surrender your whole being to me and rest in my will. From this moment, let doubt leave your mind and embrace the profound security of my presence. You will always believe it, and I am with you forever. I will never leave you. Fear not, for I am here and will never let go of your hand. Even in times of trouble, remember that I am working a great miracle within you there is a reward for your suffering, a special blessing because of your patience. Come to my arms today and renew your desire to live. 
After hearing me, rise with a strengthened soul to enjoy the good things that are coming. I want to fill you with new hopes, to remove from your life those who have caused you pain and open your heart to love again. I will bring good people into your life who will appreciate your worth and offer genuine friendship. When the time comes, happiness will knock on your door and past pains will be forgotten. Forgive, let go, and stop looking back. Your blessings are not found in the errors of the past. Do not seek those who hurt and betrayed you. Open your heart to the new plan I have for you and believe with courage and conviction that I truly love you and will bless and prosper you. I want to see you joyful, prosperous, and healthy. You have persevered through your difficulties, showing your commitment and loyalty. I am beginning a work in you that I will complete despite the obstacles and your mistakes. I will handle your enemies and clear the path ahead of you. Do not fear threats or those who seem stronger. I delight in showing you my love and power daily. I will open doors to wonderful opportunities, free you from oppressive chains, and reveal the great things I will do through you. Focus on the future with great enthusiasm and faith. Remember these words well, write them down, and rise each day full of faith. I know you trust me, but I want to hear it. Shout it with all your soul. Write it with your own hand. My God, I believe in you. I trust you. I speak to your champion heart, telling you not to give up, not to despair. I am your protector, your shield, your strength. I am your friend, your father, your God. I repeat, I am your God. You will receive blessings meant only for the brave. Rise, for today is your day of liberation. You have endured much sorrow and your strength has waned. But in your trials, you have shown great courage. For a reason, you are my child. I chose you before you were born to prosper and bless you. The enemy tried to trap you with lies to destroy your spirit, using threats to fill you with fear. Yet within your heart, there was always a flame you couldn't explain. When you reached the pit of despair, you heard my voice calling you. I sought and rescued you with great victory. You have witnessed my glory and the miracles I performed in you. Now amidst these trials, rise and stand firm. Show your enemies that in your humility and simplicity dwells my greatness. Fight through prayer and live in my power. The beautiful things you ask of me I will give according to my will. I will answer and provide what you need. I am preparing you for great things that will come soon. Focus on seeking and listening to me in the coming days. I will reveal your destiny and change your life soon. Wait for me. I love you and find joy in your happiness. When I see you sad, I always find a way to make you smile. I am not a harsh father. I do not delight in your suffering. I am not a ruthless God. I have not abandoned you. You live in perilous times where many seek to undermine your faith and envy your joy. Be vigilant about your path and the voices you heed. Some will come with promises of peace and prosperity, using deceitful words to lead you astray. They aim to convince you that you do not need me, encouraging you to live independently of my presence. Yet, you are eternally connected to me. Even in the darkest valleys, I am with you. However, if you persist in a misguided path, you will forget my promises and reject my love. You might believe you do not need my words or protection. Still, I will continue to call you, touch your heart, and gently guide you back to my will. I do not want you to stray, but if you do, you will miss me. In the world of darkness, there is no pure and sincere love. Today, you are hearing my words because I have come to warn you of deceivers with smooth words who will try to lead you astray. Do not follow them. Stay with me, where you have everything you need, without problems, surprises, lies, betrayals, or the danger of being hurt. Here with me, there is joy, 
and life. Outside, my presence you will only find sadness and loneliness. I saved and chose you to see you succeed. You will be successful in life. Believe me, according to my will, you will be a blessing and an example to your family and community. Everything you ask in prayer is heard and noted. As I have promised, I will always answer you with the best, far beyond what you asked or imagined. Follow me and I will give you a purpose for living. I will make you brave and victorious. Enemies will come against you, but you will fear none of them. Receive this blessing I am giving you. Allow my will to guide you. Fix your eyes on the goal. Do not resist. My plans are for peace, health, and prosperity for you and your family. Ask me for anything, and I will give it to you. Give me first place in everything. Immerse yourself in my word. It is a sea of hope, strength, and trust. I will lead you by the hand along this holy path. Your steps will be firm, without doubt or fear. I always have something better for you. The obstacles in your life are opportunities to demonstrate your faith and courage. If something is unclear, turn to my word as you always have. Sit and listen patiently. My Holy Spirit will come to you, granting wisdom, so you know what to do when things seem bleak. When problems arise, there is nothing to fear. In your heart, you will know there is a solution to every conflict. I am the captain of your boat, steering you to a safe harbor of blessings. If waves crash against you and winds try to knock you down, do not worry. Have faith. Resist. You will not perish. Bad news will not harm you. It has no power. Continue to sail like a child, trusting in the loving eyes watching over him and the arms that care for him. You too, look at me with faith. Think of the happiness you will have, the peace you feel today, and the day you hold all the good things you have asked of me. The heavens and the earth may pass away, but my word will not. It is eternal and powerful. Cling to it. If you still feel fear, speak it out loud to feel its release. If I promise you something, I will fulfill it. If I fulfill it, it is because I want to bless you. If I bless you, it is because you are my child. And if you are mine, I will never let you go. No one can take you away from me. You always dwell under my shadow. I love you and will always be with you. I will open the heavens to fill your hands with blessings. I will write my word in your heart so your steps will be firm and you will never depart from this love that covers you and forgives your mistakes. You are human and may fail, but I am a God of mercy. I accept your repentance and will rescue you even from the depths. My blessings are far greater than any material wealth. The treasures I have for you are more valuable than all the world's riches. If I say I will open the heavens for you, receive my promise with faith and respond, I believe you. Take my word seriously because this is not a game. My love is not hidden, it is not a mystery. Look at the sky, feel the air you breathe, the sunlight that caresses you. These are my gifts to you. It is my way of saying I love you and am here. I have cared for you many times, rescued you from pain, saved you from death when you walked in darkness. You entered this year with great spirit and desire to achieve many good things, and now that you face obstacles and trials, you will not stop. You will not halt. You will move forward. Your dreams will come true. They are important to me. I have given you a purpose that you must fulfill. I want to manifest my love and power through you. I am filling you with my Holy Spirit each day. Your spiritual sensitivity is changing. Soon you will begin to see further. You will understand people's intentions. I will give you much wisdom. You will become even more intelligent, able to touch many hearts and help them. Speak my word through your example. People will see in your life the result of your faith and what a person who knows me can do. Open your hands. You will receive.
receive great blessings. Be diligent and accept them with faith. The heavens are opening for you, but keep your heart close to me. Tell me you love me, believe in me, and will be faithful to me until the end. I will move heaven and earth for you. Wait joyfully for my blessing. Do not worry. Everything will be all right. You will be stronger and feel much better. Today is a day to close cycles in your life. The past will be left behind. Your suffering will end. Believe that you cannot remain bound to people and situations that harm you. Recently you felt sad, confused and directionless. But I was by your side. Even if you could not see me, I helped you overcome all difficulties. I do not judge or condemn you for your past. Instead, I want you to move forward with your head held high, with sincere humility. Many think they are better than you, but do not heed them. Keep walking, trusting in the strength and courage I give you today. I have spoken to you many times. I have shown you my power. Now, wait patiently and accept the good things with joy and faith. They are yours. The door will open, happiness will enter, blessings will come and tensions will end. Do not return to old habits. Let your faith be constant. Do not believe in me only momentarily and then forget my promises as time passes. Do not let discouragement, disappointment and doubts enter your heart again. You are not perfect, I already know that. I made you and chose you so you could know me. Be blessed, and through your prayers, witness many miracles. Everything will happen because of your faith in me and your acceptance of the grace and forgiveness I have given you. After you finish listening to these words, continue with your daily tasks. Do not worry or hurry, do not rush things. I know what I'm doing. Have patience. Wait for my signal before moving forward to where you need to go. Keep trusting and pay close attention to the ways I communicate with you. Open your Bible, kneel in prayer, offer me your obedience and give me the first place in your heart. What seems impossible to you, the miracle you seek, will become reality. I am the one who gives you life. I can also grant you health. Mine are the gold and the silver. The heavens and the earth tremble at my voice. The heavenly sources will open, and abundant blessings will rain down upon you. I can provide for you, and lead you to employment in places you never imagined. I can change the opinions of those who look down on you. I can transform hearts and ways of thinking. Nothing is impossible for your omnipotent God. You must rise and walk in faith. If you truly believe me, there is no time for doubts or games. Speak to your family and tell them it is time to be serious. They will pray, read my word with all their hearts, and seek me. Sometimes people insulted you, saying you are a person without talents or a future. They wanted to end you, shouting that there was no place for you in this world. But what a surprise they will have. This earth was created for you. You have my approval and my authority. I have given you the keys of faith. You have access to my heavenly throne. You were born to triumph. You are like a majestic eagle destined to soar high. Today marks a unique day, a day filled with life, a day brimming with triumphs, a day you shall hold dear in your heart. Now, stand up and proceed. Get ready for the challenges ahead. You have chosen to put your trust in me, and I will demonstrate that my plan for you is true. Ready yourself today to step into a time beyond the natural. Remember always in every moment I hear you. I am forever by your side. When I assure you that everything will be all right, trust in my words. If you continue to stress over matters you have already entrusted to me, you will find yourself depleted. Extend your hand to me. Allow me to guide you gently to serene pastures. I do not wish for you to lack anything. I yearn to fill your soul with divine love and sacred tenderness. Do not fear the adversities that may arise. You will stand strong, 
and I will be there. I will not let you go, I will not abandon you. I am aware of your weaknesses, and that is why I speak to your heart. My child, I am here with you. Instead of being consumed by confusion and desperation, sit with me and find rest for a while. Do not worry about the future or be disturbed by the world's state. Focus on what truly matters, your family, your spiritual life, nurturing your spirit with my word and praying. Be kind and show mercy to those who have wronged you, even if you have loved them deeply and they continue to mistreat you. Turn the other cheek if they strike you again. Demonstrate that you love them profoundly. Just as I laid down my life for my children, you too must fight tirelessly for your family to know me, for them to be blessed and find freedom. Stay away from those who undermine your faith, from those who ignore me and discard the gifts I bestow upon them and turn their backs on me. I have already blessed you with abundant spiritual blessings. You are seated with me in the heavenly places. I have covered you with my mantle of holiness and even the enemy fears you because he knows who he is up against. You are in this world to serve me, to bear fruit, to see your family blessed, and to be filled with happiness. In both good times and bad, you will believe in me and listen to me because you know my purpose is always for your good and prosperity. You and I are so united that you feel and know that something supernatural, divine, and wonderful is happening in your heart. Your eyes are opening to promises you did not know. Changes are happening. The day is coming, and the miracle you expect is about to happen. Fill yourself with joy, because even more beautiful things are coming to you. I love you. People do not decide your destiny. Doors open when I order and decide. I will pour all my love and affection on you and your family. No one will separate you from me. I will love you eternally and will not change my mind. Even if you make a thousand mistakes, my grace and forgiveness are always available to you. I am with you. That is my eternal promise. I will never leave you nor forsake you. You must stand firm in your faith so that no one diverts you from this truth. Feed on the word that gives life, not on hurtful slanders. Hear me speak of my eternal love every day, so that all doubt, sadness, and depression flee from your heart. You are my child. My covenant with you is sealed with my own blood. Do not fear, I am with you. I give you strength, peace, and power. This is your answer. From today, you will be victorious and everything will be different. Believe in my promises. Be strong and courageous. Trust in me, and everything will be different. I am speaking to your soul, the word that will remove all doubt and confusion from your mind. You are surrounded by my divine protection with thousands of angels around you, waiting for my signal to defend you, to guard your family, to drive away the lying enemy who tries to trap you in his snares. A wonderful time of peace and abundance is coming. I want you to fly high like the eagle, and from those heights see how your family changes and is greatly blessed by your beautiful faith. My love and blessing are with you, never doubt it. Stop grieving, many beautiful and wonderful blessings are about to happen to you. Be calm and do not despair, for many good and marvelous blessings are coming your way. Trust and do not lose hope, for in quietness and trust, you will find the strength to overcome any adversity and the wisdom to seize every blessing that will come into your life. My child, just trust, for the fruits of your labor are near. Your harvest will be bountiful and your joy immense. Your mouth will be filled with laughter and your heart with praise, for my blessing upon you is great. Do not be discouraged nor saddened, for the negative things you see will not reach you. Rejoice, for the word I have spoken over you has not returned empty, but has borne fruit, renewing your spirit, increasing your finances, and bringing joy to your life. 
From today, everything will change. The flame within you that was fading will be rekindled, for I'm giving you a new life, a life filled with peace, joy, and abundance. The old things have passed away and everything is made new. Move forward and do not let your mind dwell on the past. Live in the present with faith and look to the future with hope. Do not worry about the vain and fleeting things of this world, but focus on the good and true things that will nourish your soul. Remember that your life in this world is temporary, but in heaven, it is eternal. So hold on to your faith and claim all my promises. Write down all your dreams, goals, and desires on a piece of paper and bring them to me in prayer. Present them to me every morning and lay them on the altar. Put everything in my hands. I assure you, if you do this with faith, you will receive everything you ask for. I promise to fulfill the desires of your heart. Everything you do will prosper. Your efforts, your work, and your dedication will not be in vain. Every seed you plant in faith will sprout and yield abundant fruit. There will be no financial commitment that cannot be met, for I will give you the wisdom to manage the blessings I place in your hands. When that day comes, there will be no room for sadness. You will jump and laugh for joy. Doors that were once closed will open, opportunities will flow, and your family relationships will be restored. You will feel a deep and lasting joy that emanates from the depths of your being. On that day, you will understand that it was I who arranged everything in your path so that you may have a harmonious and abundant life. A life of faith, where your destiny is redirected and your life prospers in everything you do, like a leafy tree that bears fruit in its season and whose leaves do not wither. All I ask is that you trust me at all times, keep my word, and love your neighbor as I love you. Always keep your heart open to my voice. Seek my wisdom day and night, and trust my perfect plan for your life. Do not be discouraged in the face of adversities, for in them you will find opportunities to grow and be strengthened. Remember, I love you beyond what you can understand. My love for you is infinite, and I will always be ready to pour out blessings upon you. I will never abandon you. Never. Trust me in the dark days and the days of light, and you will see how everything will go well for you. At this moment, lift your head and prepare to receive the blessings I have promised you. Prepare to shine as a child of light and radiate the light of my love to those around you. Let your laughter spread happiness and joy. Share your blessings with those who have less. Today, remember that I love you more than you can comprehend. My love for you is infinite, and I am always willing to pour out grace, forgiveness, and blessings upon your life. Never tire of believing. Persevere and give your all. I will be with you, guiding each of your steps, both in dark days and days of light. Remember, you were born to triumph. Keep the flame of faith alive within you, and you will see my promises fulfilled in you, transforming your reality and filling your heart with joy and gratitude. Move forward with all your trust placed in me. I will prosper you in everything you undertake, making you wise and prudent, so that everything you do in this world turns out well. You only need to believe in me. Never forget that my purpose is to make you a blessed, prosperous, and victorious person. Prepare yourself, for I am about to work a wondrous miracle in your life that everyone will witness. Today, I want to speak directly to your heart so you can grasp the immense love I have for you, a love that is pure and unconditional. Because of this love, I have never abandoned you. I have always been by your side, even when you didn't seek me. In your moments of loneliness and despair, when life led you down difficult and dark paths, I was there. Every tear, every sigh of anguish, and every pressure in your heart, I felt deeply within me. Your pain was my pain, and your joy was my joy. 
No emotion escapes my notice, nor a thought of yours that I do not know. You are deeply loved, and I would never leave you. I understand you feel alone at times, that no one comprehends you, and that your good deeds go unnoticed. But that is not true, for I am always with you. In every step you take, in every decision you make, I am there supporting and strengthening you. Never doubt my presence in your life, for I am your rock, your salvation, and your refuge. Know this, you are most precious to me. I am always aware of your needs and the deepest desires of your heart. I know your yearnings, fears, and dreams. Even when it seems I am not listening to your prayers, I assure you that I am, and I am working silently in your favor. My heart's desire is to help you achieve your goals and grant you the miracle you have long sought. That is why I tell you today, with complete certainty, that I will work a miracle in your life. It does not matter what you are facing, no matter how impossible the situation seems, I have the power to turn everything in your favor. I am the God of miracles and nothing is impossible for me. You may have lost hope, stopped believing that things can get better, but today I tell you, do not give up. No matter how dark the path seems, or how hard the journey is, those who wait on me will always find a light at the end of the tunnel, for that light is me. So today, lift your eyes to the sky and trust that I will do something wonderful in your life. What seems impossible to man, and what science cannot comprehend, I make possible. You may be doubting now, but I assure you that what I will do in your life will dispel all doubts. It will be extraordinary and will testify to my divine power and goodwill for those who trust in me. You only need to believe, and I will do it. Do not be afraid, trust in me, and your miracle will happen. I never fail those who trust in me, for I am the rock that sustains you in moments of doubt and despair. I am your refuge and strength. Come to me for comfort and guidance. You will always find peace in my presence. Do not fear asking for help, for I am here to listen and provide everything you need. Remember that no matter how dark the path or steep the mountain, I am always by your side, watching over you. No matter how challenging your circumstances, trust that I am working in your life in ways you cannot imagine. Regardless of what you have done in the past or what you may do in the future, I will always work in your favor, for I love you and my love is eternal and unbreakable. Lift your head, my child, and trust that the miracle I have prepared for you will soon manifest. Keep the flame of faith alive in your heart, and you will see your deepest dreams come true. For I am the God of the impossible, and everything is possible for those who believe in me. May my words today fill your heart with hope and strength, reminding you that my love is greater than any obstacle you may face. Trust in me, and you will see my power working wonders in your life. Place your worries, dreams, and desires into my hands, and watch as I surprise you with my goodness and mercy. Amen.